Ever paid a friend back for dinner on Venmo and then regretted not having actual cash on hand? Maybe you're a freelancer or a small business owner who relies on Venmo for transactions, but sometimes a crisp bill feels more satisfying. So, the burning question, can you actually convert your Venmo balance into physical cash you can hold? Let's face it, Venmo is a fantastic tool for splitting bills, sending quick payments to friends, and even managing small business transactions. But it operates primarily in the digital realm. There's no physical Venmo card you can swipe, and you can't exactly walk into an ATM and withdraw your Venmo funds. But fear not, cash connoisseurs. There are actually a few ways to bridge the gap between your Venmo balance and the wonderful world of paper money. Here's the rundown on your options, each with its own set of pros and cons. 1. Transfer to bank account. This is the most straightforward approach. Most Venmo accounts are linked to a bank account. You can initiate a transfer from your Venmo balance to your linked bank account. Once the transfer clears, which usually takes 1 to 3 business days, you can then withdraw the money from your bank account using an ATM or a teller. Pros, easy and convenient, especially if your bank account is already linked. Cons, transfer times can feel like an eternity, especially if you need the cash right away. There might also be fees associated with bank transfers, depending on your bank's policy. 2. Use a debit card cash advance. If your Venmo account is linked to a debit card, you might be able to utilize a cash advance option. This essentially involves using your Venmo balance to withdraw cash from an ATM, but with your debit card. Pros, faster access to cash compared to bank transfers. Cons, cash advance fees can be brutal. They typically involve a hefty upfront fee plus high interest rates that start accruing immediately. This option should be a last resort unless you're truly desperate. 3. Pay a friend and get reimbursed. This might sound a little old school, but it works. Send the money you need in cash to a friend on Venmo, and then have them meet you and hand you the equivalent amount in physical bills. Pros, quick and potentially fee-free if your friend is understanding, although splitting a cab or lunch might be a nice gesture. Cons, relies on having a trustworthy friend available and willing to meet up. Not ideal if you need a large sum of cash. 4. Use a Venmo debit card, coming soon. There's a light at the end of the tunnel for cash enthusiasts. Venmo has announced plans to release a debit card sometime in the future. This card would supposedly allow you to make purchases directly from your Venmo balance and potentially withdraw cash from ATMs. Pros, the dream scenario. Direct access to your Venmo balance for both payments and cash withdrawals. Cons, this option isn't available yet, and there's no concrete release date on the horizon. We'll have to wait and see what limitations or fees might be attached to the Venmo debit card. The verdict. While there's no instant Venmo to cash magic trick, you do have a few options depending on your needs and priorities. Transferring to your bank account offers convenience, but with a wait time. Debit card cash advances are fast, but come at a steep financial cost. Paying a friend might work in a pinch, and the upcoming Venmo debit card holds promise, but details are still under wraps. Ultimately, the best approach depends on your situation. Need the cash quickly and don't mind the fees? A cash advance might be your only option, but use it responsibly. If you can wait a few days, a bank transfer might be the most cost-effective solution. Remember, always consider any associated fees before making a decision. And hey, maybe this is a good reminder to keep a little emergency cash stashed away for those times when the digital world just won't cut it. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.